When Iran decided to protect its own skies, no one believed it could succeed. But now, with the Bavar 373 system, Iran's skies are more secure and enemies dare not approach. A defense system that emerged from the heart of sanctions now stands alongside major global powers. If you want to know how Iran built an iron shield on its own, stay with me. As you may know, Bavar 373 is a long-range air defense system developed and manufactured by Iran's Ministry of Defense. This system was designed to counter various modern aerial threats, such as stealth aircraft, cruise missiles, and ballistic missiles. The name Bavar means belief, symbolizing trust in domestic capability, and 373 refers to the project's launch date. It was first unveiled in 2019 and was immediately positioned as Iran's rival to Russia's S-300. Its development was the result of years of experience, sanctions, and the indigenous evolution of defense systems. Bavar 373 is equipped with multiple advanced radars that can detect targets across different ranges. Its primary radar, called MERSAD-4, can detect targets up to 350 kilometers away and track them within 260 kilometers. The system's fire control radar can track and engage six targets simultaneously. These radars use AESA Active Electronically Scanned Array technology, providing high precision and resistance to electronic warfare. Mounted on mobile trucks, the radars are highly maneuverable and can be repositioned quickly. This gives the system flexibility in rapidly changing battlefield scenarios. The main missile used by Bavar 373 is the Syed 4 with a range of up to 300 kilometers. This missile uses solid fuel and is guided by a combination of active and semi-active radar homing. Syed 4 can engage targets at altitudes above 27 kilometers. In its terminal phase, it uses an active seeker to increase hit probability. Other Syed variants, 1 to 3, are also used in similar systems. Bavar 373's structural design is not copied from Russian systems. It has been independently developed. Its launcher system is vertical VLS, allowing the simultaneous firing of six missiles. Each launcher has six firing cells, capable of engaging multiple targets at once. This design enhances the agility and combat readiness of the system. All components, including launchers, radars, and command control, are mounted on separate mobile vehicles. One unique feature of Bavar 373 is its ability to detect stealth and low observable targets. It uses a mix of frequency bands to track radar evading aircraft. In field tests, it successfully detected targets with low radar cross sections. In hypothetical combat scenarios, this capability reduces enemy air superiority. The system also incorporates increased radar precision to counter electronic warfare. The system's command unit uses domestically developed software with a Persian interface. This central command can coordinate multiple Bavar 373 systems in an integrated manner. By analyzing radar inputs, it prioritizes threats and makes real-time decisions. Encrypted communication protocols enhance the security of its command networks. It can also integrate with other systems like Tabas or Third of Kordad. Bavar 373 can operate across various terrains, mountains, deserts, and maritime regions. It has been tested in extreme temperatures and high winds performing reliably. Its components are resistant to humidity, dust, and mechanical shock. During military drills, the system has been deployed in remote areas and executed operations successfully. Its high mobility and rapid deployment are key advantages. The system can simultaneously engage multiple aerial targets. Bavar 373 is capable of tracking and firing at six targets at once. This is particularly crucial in defending against missile saturation attacks or drone swarms. The system employs artificial intelligence to prioritize threats based on their nature. It also features rapid decision-making to respond to sudden threats. 
compared to the S300, Bavar 373 outperforms in certain aspects. Notably in missile range and indigenous system design, Iran has achieved technological independence. Its radars are newer and more resistant to interference. Though not more advanced than the S-400, Bavar 373 is a serious competitor to the S-300. Being fully domestic is a major advantage under sanctions. Bavar 373 is part of Iran's integrated air defense network. Alongside systems like 3rd of Kordad, Tabas, and Raid, it provides extensive air coverage. The coordination of these systems boosts the country's ability to respond to complex, multi-dimensional threats. Digital links between systems enable real-time target data sharing. Each unit acts as a piece of a larger defense puzzle. Live fire tests of Syed-4 missiles from Bavar. 373 were conducted in the presence of senior military officials. The missiles successfully struck designated targets at high altitudes and speeds. These tests were conducted in various regions, including deserts and the south of Iran. Footage of the launches has been broadcast by state media. Domestic experts have described the system's performance as satisfactory. Iran has announced plans to export Bavar 373 to allied and friendly nations. Several countries in Africa and South America have shown interest in the system. Given its lower cost compared to Western alternatives, it holds economic appeal. Successful exports could boost Iran's foreign revenue and soft power. Exports will be subject to international regulations and political considerations. One ongoing project is the enhancement of the Sayyad-4 missile to an even longer range version. There's potential for a 400 kilometer range high speed variant. Future models may feature stronger warheads and more advanced guidance systems. New radars capable of detecting low altitude targets are also in development. Iran remains focused on the evolution of next generation defense systems. Foreign analysts view Bavar 373 as a key part of Iran's deterrent strategy against regional threats. Given Iran's geopolitical position, readiness against aerial threats is essential. The presence of foreign bases around the country increases the need for robust air defense. Rather than relying on east or west, Iran emphasizes indigenous development. Bavar 373 symbolizes this strategic direction in air defense.